Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is a really rather grotty day, so I'm not standing out in the rain. My rollers are not out. We have just welcomed our first guest, but as usual, I'm running around like a headless chicken. And today is an extremely special day. I'm dressed in red, white, and blue for the King's coronation. And of course, we are having a party, so I thought I would share it with you. I'm gonna try and show you the outside of the house with the bunting but I'm trying not to get my hair wet but I, before the rest of the guests arrived I thought I would give you a very very quick tour of all of our decorations it is going to be quite the day it does look somewhat tacky to what you're normally used to seeing but what a special day and I cannot wait to share it with you guys. So whilst I was in Mallorca I had lots of fun ordering all the bunting on Amazon. Look at this, we've got gorgeous blue hydrangeas and when you come into the house we have King Charles has made it for the drinks reception. <laughs> We have Archie who very very is kindly helping us serve all the drinks. Oh, that's very generous of you. May I have a glass? Thank you very very much. And then we go through the hallway and into the dining room. We've gone with a blue theme in the dining room today. Obviously there is no better occasion than the King's coronation. We don't tend to go blue in here but I think it looks gorgeous. And look at these hydrangeas. Aren't they magnificent? The rest of the florals is actually from the garden. I arrived late last night from Mallorca and mummy has helped me get everything together. Trust me, we've been up since about 5 a.m. and doesn't it look fabulous? We are going to have such a fun day today. We've got the TV started. It is 10.30 in the morning. Of course, we've been watching the procession. We've been watching all the royals arrive, all the heads of states. It is going to be the most magical day. Right, let's keep going through to the kitchen. We've got some gorgeous hydrangeas. King Charles has dotted throughout the house and we've gone rather extra with our dress code for today's celebration. So we have more bunting, hydrangeas, all the candles are lit and this is our tablescape. Very, very quickly put together, but I think it looks stunning. Daddy, are you going to show everybody your dress code for today? Today. Let me see what you're wearing. Oh, fantastic! Daddy's got his top hat on. You got your medals. Beautiful waitress today. <laughs> Mummy, what do we have here? Uh, Crown's eggs. Oh, the little birdie sure. with celery much. salt, darling. And tell me about the outfit today. So, where's uh, yes, the hat from? Um, well, I found it in the loft oh. about uh, 20 minutes ago. <laughs>
elegance here for the outfits. As you can see, she's rocking fabulous Zimmerman with Jimmy Choo. Tell me about the fascinator. Where is the fascinator from? Etsy. Oh, Etsy, I love it. <laughs> Etsy and the luxury Chanel, Jimmy Choo and Zimmerman. Love it. <laughs> Look at him. He must be exhausted. Oh, they are finally ready to come out. The oven is beating them away. I hope they taste as good as they look. <laughs> Good morning! What a day yesterday was. We are all definitely feeling a little bit worse for wear. Um, it ended at about, I think, 11.30 or maybe midnight, and we had guests arrive from 10 a.m., so it was a long day. But we take those days extremely seriously. We had every single television on in the house. Everybody watched every single second of the coronation, and wasn't it mesmerizing everything from the traditions to the outfits the fashion the royal family the politics and just the way that we do things in this country is just truly remarkable and feeling extremely proud to be british and part of just this incredible country to continue the coronation celebrations we are popping down to hambledon which is our local village and they are having a village party so we feel like we need to take part we are taking down some champagne and some nibbles the boys are already down there so we have just made some homemade sausage rolls some champagne some dips and some crispy bits so the girls myself mummy and Kimberly are going down to join the boys and continue the incredible celebrations please excuse my very tired and slightly hungover face I am wearing a very chilled outfit today I'm wearing one of my favorite pairs of classic Carmina loafers pair of Lily silk cream trousers, a Holland Cooper belt, and a Lily silk blouse, as well as my favorite Van Cleef earrings. I'm feeling absolutely mentally, physically exhausted, but we're gonna have a gorgeous family day. We're in the car, and we are just about to pop down to Hamilton. We've got Mummy Hello. in the front, and we've got Aunt Kimberly in the back. We are really sporting the sunglasses today, ladies. Has that got something to do with the amount um, of champagne? Just, just a tad. Just a tad. We're having fabulous coronation celebrations, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Fantastic. Yesterday was quite something, wasn't it, Mummy? 
It was an amazing, amazing day with wonderful friends, wonderful food, wine, and to watch the coronation was just a, you know, will always stay in my memory forever. I think that's, I mean, we always have a royal party, whether it's Jubilee, we did the Silver Jubilee. We did the Silver Jubilee and we did the 70 years on the throne. We did Kate and William's wedding, wedding and yeah. Harry's wedding. Yeah. We always have a royal party yeah. when there's a royal celebration. Absolutely right. I'm going to pop you here and we are going to drive down to Hamilton for the Royal Coronation Village Party. <laughs> Everybody. Happy Monday. What a weekend it has been. I'm in the garden just with the boys. Hmm? Do you want to say hi? Odie, you want to say hi? Hello everybody. This is the smart house that is Lord Odie von Lothenthal. <laughs> Oh my goodness me, what a weekend. I'm so sorry that I didn't get that much time to film everything. It's certainly not one of my normal vlogs, but I wanted to be able to show you guys a little snippet rather than not film at all. But it just happened to be one of those days where I literally got hardly any time at all, but it was so special. And also to take it all in, we had every single television on in the house, watched the whole thing from start to finish, and it was really a day to remember. Last night we watched the Coronation concert. How fabulous was that? Katy Perry, oh my goodness me, spine tingling, raw. It's one of my favorite songs. <laughs> As you know, I adore inspirational songs. So anything like Unstoppable or Hear Me Roar, it's one of my songs. <laughs> And I just think that our country is amazing. And actually, I just want to, to stop on that note. If the royal family is not your thing and you're not patriotic and you don't believe in the monarchy, I really, really, really would be so grateful if you could refrain from writing any nasty comments below. It's just, I'm not pushing my views or any political views on anyone else. I adore the royal family and I am a royalist through and through. Um, after all, my dog is a lord. <laughs> And it's just been the most special weekend and a weekend that I will remember for the rest of my life. I'm so sorry again that this vlog will be so short, but trust me when I say that there is so much coming. I will actually let you in on a little secret this weekend. I have a YouTube special. Not only will I be posting an almost an hour long vlog on Sunday, I will also be posting an almost hour long vlog on Saturday. I am so excited. So it's gonna be going up in episode one and episode two, Luxury by Leonora in Mallorca, 24 campaigns in five days. And um, it was one of the best 
trips I've ever done, quite possibly one of my biggest career trips I've ever done and um, I, I can't even put into words to explain how happy, excited, proud and almost a little bit nervous for you guys to see it. Um, anyway, oh, that's the boys. Somebody's probably just walked in the back door so I am going to say goodbye. Thank you so much for watching, sending so much love and I can't wait for this weekend.